This is Good Morning Mumbai with Rishi K. Some interesting data from Sachin Tendulkar back in his playing days. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Take us through that. So, very interesting, right? When, uh, this was Sachin's last test uh, at 1K Day. And uh, we were a very young organization that time and looking to get some sort of, uh, uh, you know, acceptance in in the business world. And so we decided to process, decided to ride on the Sachin wave at that time. And we decided to process um, about 8 to 10 million fans of, of Sachin. And what we found was very, very interesting is that um, pretty much 90% of Sachin's fans, um, um, you know, correlated Sachin and Pepsi. Um, and, and whereas at that time, I mean, I didn't see anything out of, um, you know, uh, out of whack there until we did some Google searches and we found that Sachin was actually uh, a brand ambassador for Coca-Cola at that point of time. So um, that was that was startling and so we quickly put that out as a blog post. It went to the right people, it went viral um, and within a week we had both Pepsi and Coke calling us asking us how did that happen? Well, Pepsi <laughs> laughed its way to the bank. Um, uh, but yeah, um, we had to share some of the methodology with them. But that was very, very interesting. And that's when we knew we were sitting on something really, really powerful. Of course. So, you know, uh, the founder of the World Wide Web, Sir Tim Berners-Lee, is on your advisory board. The yes. great Ratan Tata is an investor. Right. Also, uh, Deb Roy. Yeah? Yes. He's the chief media scientist at uh, Twitter. Wow. Um, and, and of um, course, the wonderful Prahlad Kakkar. <laughs> <laughs> yes, Prahlad. And there's a bit, a bit of trivia on Prahlad here, as far as your life is concerned. <laughs> uh, yes, Prahlad, um, Prahlad and Mithali um, both have been um, big champions of what we do. Um, and both um, with Kyazunga as well as with Infinite Analytics. In fact, um, um, a great deal of my life is owed to Prahlad because I met my wife Shivani um, at Prahlad's office. Um, I, <laughs> when we were setting up Kazunga, um, and I was, I used to work in the Bay Area um, in, in, in San Francisco, and um, I was on my, one of my trips here to figure out and set up um, base here. And in Prahlad's office is when I uh, ran into Shivani, and um, I saw her from distance and immediately flipped. Um, and uh, I knew she was the one, and, and Prahlad saw that. Um, got me to uh, got her to uh, talk to me, and that was the, I, I guess the fastest way I've ever gotten a phone number from a girl. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, and then um, um, you know, Prahlad uh, mentioned that you know I shouldn't move back for work; I should move back for a woman. And I was like, well, who's that going to be? And and move back. Uh, you know, Shivani was no longer with Prahlad, but it took me two years to find her. And it turned out that she lived two, two minutes away from where I lived in Bombay. So, um, but yeah, so uh, Prahlad has played um, a big role in my life. Uh, he's also, um, Mithali and he are also investors um, in, um, in Infinite Analytics. So, um, some connection, I guess. <laughs> wow. So basically, you've told us why uh, Argentina yeah. didn't make it to the knockout stage. You've told us commonalities between um, Rajkumar Rao, the actor, and Jaden Smith, yes. and also also the NBA, and Kendrick Lamar. Right. And now you tell us a love story. <laughs> <laughs> okay. It has been a comprehensive interview, Akash Bhatia. Well, thanks for having me. <laughs> thank, thank you very, very much. It has been fun. And, uh, it has. All yes. the best to you and Infinite Analytics. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you, Rishi K. Up ahead, the Bloomberg Queen Minute. You want to go anywhere. My name is Rishi K. We're live.